Hey guys, what's up? This is Ark Warden, and today we're gonna go continue our adventures, and we're gonna go to Mount Moon. So that is great. But um, if you haven't seen my last video, it was the shortest episode ever. Take a look at this shiny Pidgey. Very happy about this. Pretty much, it's um, it's you know, um. Very, what am I trying to say? It's it's incredibly rare to find a shiny Pokemon. It's like one in eight thousand or something, one in eight thousand one hundred twenty something chance of happening. So I'm very very happy to have that. Um, my name is Adele. I have no idea why it was the very first thing that came to mind. Now I have not told the person that I do this let, let's play with that. That is also I also got a shiny, but they will find out shortly. So. Let me move this over here, and let me move my mic a little bit. Okay, so, we're going to go into Mount Moon, and I also changed uh, Adele to be the new partner of mine in this, uh, well, it hiccuped. I also changed Adele, my new partner in my Let's Play. So, let's hope Adele will prove, is it a boy or a girl? I want to check. I think it's, it's a boy, so I, I shouldn't have not named Adele. But who cares, really? Now... I am just, it was sort of unreal at first when I first saw a shiny. It was like, what the hell is up with this? And then I was like, oh, it's a shiny Pokemon. But I'm, I'm never going to get bored of that shiny sparkle at the beginning. Look at that. It's so awesome. Okay, TM09, what is that? Uh, TM, is there a TM case? Yeah, there's a TM case. Bullet Seed and Rock Tomb. Who could learn Rock Tomb? Uh, I could learn Rock Tomb, yeah. Uh, uh, I don't need low kick anymore, cause, well, you know, I could take away low kick. Let's take away low kick. Okay, sweet. I'm gonna go, and, well, in the next episode, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go try to defeat, um, I'm gonna try to get a Nidoran, which is like 1% chance of catching one. Who knows, maybe I'll find another shiny, because that's the same spot where I found a shiny Pidgey. Um, I didn't see that. Uh, Kakuna. Kakuna Matata. I love that Pokemon. Um, so we're going to go and defeat this annoying as hell Kakuna, because it's using hard and wasting our time. Um, go learn quick attack. It's pretty good. Uh, let's go up here. There's an item, but first this stupid annoying Zubat. You know, just like your brother in Golbats, no one loves you. You don't you have a family, just no one loves you. Um, so yeah. Clefairy, I switch into Riboflavin. Ah, that did a lot. An unannoy an annoying amount to be exact. And Gia dude we're not gonna get because we can't evolve it. That's the thing. Zubat we're not gonna get because Zubat no one loves Zubat and no other Zubat we're not gonna get because that one's also Zubat but it's lower level than regular Zubat. Anyways, we're gonna go defeat this trainer and he has a Caterpie which is deserves to die. He has a Farfetch which also deserves to die with by H two O. I was I, how did I read Farfetch? I thought it was a Farfetch. What the hell? Anyways, Caterpie switching to Adele. I have no idea why I named it Adele. I really don't know. So strange. Let's go and get. Ooh, we got our candy. And Magnemite. We have to switch out. I switch out to Riboflavin. You could easily deal damage to those Magnemites. Uh, Karate Chop. Take it out one hit. Voltorb. Let's switch to. Yeah, Riboflavin should stay in it at this point. Uh, I could use Rock Team actually. That would have been better. Yeah. Defeated the super nerd. Uh, got a potion. Let's get out of here. Okay. So, guys. Now, I am starting to believe I should, you know, be more humorous with what I say. Like the joke with the, what did the Salamence say to the Shellgon? You should level up. But that one was really bad, you see? 
I shouldn't really do that joke because it was really, really bad. It's a badless person. Whoa, look at that. She's tripping on acid. Oh my god, guys. Okay. We're going to go defeat this Oddish. It's okay because Adele is shiny enough. Oh, something in my eye. What the hell? Ugh. I didn't read where the last Pokemon was because my eye was hurting. Bell Sprout. Uh, let's go for a scratch. And let's go for one more scratch and take it out. Let's go over here. Bug person. I, I might want to catch another Pokemon here. I really want a Nero King. That's what it is, yeah. Really want one of those. And I always wonder, are Shari Pokemon a tad bit stronger than regular Pokemon? Like, are they they have like a little bit extra stats or something? Because I don't know. Or do they just look cooler and rare to cool to collect and stuff? Because I really don't know. On my black version, I have like a hundred shiny Pokemon. I did not hack them. Although me, me, me and my friends used to shiny hunting sometimes, so that's pretty cool. We do a lot of shiny hunting, which is nice and really fun to do. And we kill that Zubat. I'm thinking of actually putting a what's it called? Um. Uh. What am I thinking of? I'm thinking of putting my um, H2O in front because he can just kill all the Geodudes in one hit with all the wild ones and get a bunch of experience points from that. Um, Water Gun. No. Water Gun again. No. And another Water Gun. Take all that out in one hit. I think we're gonna, love, we're gonna evolve from this. Whoa, H2O is evolving. Come on, H2O. Who cares? I want to speed this up. There we go. He looks shiny for some reason. Although he's not shiny, he just looks shiny. He's purple though. Moonstone. Let's go down here. Paris. If he was shiny, he would have a little sparkle around him like Adele has. Oh, Adele. Let's change. I didn't mean to go to the Pokedex. Let's go to right. I put a Dell in front for now. Battle this dude. Rattata, no match for my Adele. Adele, use Gus. I cannot imagine that in real life. Sand trees gonna get destroyed by H2O. Like you see, like it. I don't, I don't even know. That's really stupid. That's really freaking stupid. Let's put H2O back in front, just get him some nice experience points. I could use a potion next time or whatever. Let's use his water gun. Clefairy, gonna run away from that thing. Paris. Parasect, Paris, Parasect. Okay. I go up here. And I see an LRG dude who deserves to die. And you can get a lot of good experience in this place. There we go. And I'm thinking the Pokemon that I'm gonna get for my um Zubat. I'll switch into a gel. I'm thinking the Pokemon that I'm gonna get for my um for the the evolution thing is probably gonna be uh Kabutops, however. I I always get Omanite and Omastar. I don't know why, it's just something I do all the time. But yeah. These fossils, no, they're not yours. They're going to be. I wish we take both of them. Be like, oh well, I beat you. I should be able to take both of them. But you know, that's not how this game works. I'm got poisoned by poison gas. Great. Voltorb. I'm gonna send Riboflavin. Use that big rock tomb. I did nothing at all. Okay, there we go. I didn't even use this Pokemon. I just gonna keep this Pokemon in rock tomb again. Oh god. Okay, he's dead. I'm gonna send in Adele. I'm gonna gust. Now I'm gonna, 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 gonna go to the Pokemon Center, I suppose. Be defeated her. Okay. Uh, Helix, and there's a dome. I'll take the dome fossil. So I'm gonna go. Ah, my ear hurts. I'm gonna uh, heal with potion. Uh, just one potion on Adele. And then an antidote on H2O, just so I can get out of the cave safe enough. And I'll heal up. 
see what's over here. I don't think there's really anything first. Whoops. Whoa, there's more stuff. Oh, here's the exit. Well, let me go over here. And you know, I think if you go over there, they can't go back. Is that true? Yeah, I'm going to go back. Well, actually, on this part now, guys, I really appreciate you guys for watching these parts. I'll see you all next time.